Hey team, and welcome back to the Fallout 4 Let's Play. I have a very important question to ask all of you. You gotta let me know about it in the comments down below, and you gotta answer it honestly. Vikings versus Spartans. Who would win, and who do you like more? I'm very anxious to know your answer. Anyways, let's get into the episode. Prepare yourself emotionally for my imminent demise. Of course, it will be a terrible, terrible loss for all of us, including me. Wait. You guys like watching me die, don't you? Sickos. Alright, here we are. It was corporations like this that put the last nail in the coffin for mankind. He and really hates, uh, corporations. You know, if I could, if I could put a cowboy hat on top of dance, it probably, uh, probably would. Look at these wrecks. It appears as though the facility's automated security's already been dealt with. Uh huh. Yeah, I see that. I see that. Damn it! I was hoping to avoid this. Look at the evidence. There isn't a single uh -huh. spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight. These robots were assaulted by Institute Six. Uh huh. Sins. I'll be on the lookout. Roger that. Let's move out. A synth is a synthetic human being robotic thing. You seen them in one of the previous episodes when uh you know I got killed a lot and then I said never mind on that and then we left. Yeah, it's because of those guys. And that's why I wanted to wait on this episode. But you know what? YOLO. And if we can do this episode, we might go back to the main story and do stuff with that. Although I'm gonna do uh some uh some of them side quests. Spoiler alert. Password? Probably gonna be in here. Yep, yeah, see, we got the password. There we go. Are gonna do ourselves a favor? Equip one of these. Just, uh, do it. Because if you don't, there's going to be robots in here. Like, as soon as we open that door. They're not there now, but, you know. Yeah. We're going to play. While we're... Why the heck are they making we're going to listen this to our imminent doom. Oh, crap. It's on, isn't it? <laughs> um, this is Technician Rand, our Jet Propulsion Division. I'm here with Technician Janowski. We're yeah, see how they weren't there a moment ago? And now they are. Jowski and I have been working on the Mars shot project for about three months now, and I think we have the thrust calculations worked out. Bam! Bam! Yeah! Man, we were smart. I wish I was headed up there with those guys. It'd be nice to get the hell away from our lousy planet. Easy. We don't record these logs for Bam. Get fired. Why am I not doing damage to you? Oh, okay, I am. Bada bing, bada boom. Why are you not? Aim is not here. Why aim not here? You know what? Take this. Yeah. 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 All these weapons, they're great for plastic. But I'm trying not to imagine getting my head blown off when I'm on the front line. My mind on work is helping me deal with Prioritize loot. Maybe that doesn't make sense to you, but it's important. While he goes okay. and kills everything. That is the plan All right. here. Sorry. Look, why don't you toss the stage and we'll start it anyway? Oh. Bam! Bada beam bada boom bah. Okay. So, yeah. See, they have the upper hand here because they have high ground. Having the high ground is an, is an instant win in most war situations. Not always, though. Free military grade stuff. Free synth stuff. Just free stuff all around. Don't you love it? Institute rifle? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wrong. Disarm that. For some reason, it's bad for us to take that or to disarm that. 
Why? I don't know. Do I care? Probably not. Can I open this? <gasps> I can open this. I forgot I could open this. Got it open. Never mind. That's it. Anti freeze frag. Pulse grenade. Useful. We are already almost overweight. Doesn't that upset you? Because it upsets me. Sweet. We want that for the gear. Alright. Kim bitch. Don't. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Don't want to really waste any of our stuff like that. Psycho jet. Okay. I'll make one of those. Yeah. Robot repair kit. We don't want any of those yet. Might want some of those later on. Okay. We don't need any of this stuff. I wish. Wait. Steel. Because I don't use steel a lot. <laughs> we just made something useful. Uh, I love useful. Where did dance go? Here we are. Turpentine, shotgun, combat, short combat shotgun. That's definitely useful. To, to give to somebody. Ah, uh, wait, no. Can't drop down there yet. There we go. Great. Ignore me and my looting. Did he go up here? He did go up here. Bingo. Magazine here for a weapon here. Okay. There's a lot of stuff there. It's lore based. If you want to if you want me to go over some more stuff I can. You don't have to leave a comment in the video below, though, because, yeah, I need to know that you'll actually want to listen to that. I don't want to be sitting here boring you with Fallout War that some person has probably already made. Nuka-Cola! Yes. Uh, that has bruise in it. A uh, space deuce. Get it? Space dust? A uh, space dust. Uh, I'm, I'm done. Uh, you can loot this. Wait there. Come on. Over here. Eh. There we go. Vacuum tubes are kind of used. This is a bathroom. Or if you have to use the bathroom. Or if you want to hide for your life. Uh, bam, bam, bam. And we're overweight. You know what that means, right? Dog meat's gonna come in handy here. Yeah. Free nuka cola. Where's my companion? When I need him. I need to eat, anyways. Bam. Bam. Properly fed, and now we're gonna go down here, and we're not gonna, we're gonna use a red stag, uh... Do you have any red stag meat? Grilled red stag, bam! That... that go up? It did, okay, cool. Here we go! Should be our final stop. What he means by that? That's right! Dog meat can't carry anymore. What do you mean he can't carry anymore? We're gonna take that. We're gonna give you six of these. No. I guess that's not how that works. Okay, well. Uh, yeah. Um. Er, pain. So, this is gonna be one of those episodes where I pick up running. everything. Looks like And I cry about it later, about, uh, you know, not having enough carry weight. 
That right there is a rocket thruster. For those of you that are uneducated in rocket science. The transmitter should be in the control room at the top of the core. But it looks like the elevators are dead. We'll have to keep heading down for now. Find a way to get the facility's power back online. There's gonna be an army of robots. Scout the maintenance area off of the main chamber. See, that's the bonus thing about, uh, you know, what's it called? Power armor. You can easily jump down and be like, you know what, bruh? Geet. Hell yeah. Freaking fracking legendary thing there. Jeering, leering, laughing, mocking, taunting. Oh, this guy sounds like he's a sociopath. I know a thing or two about sociopaths. I've been one. Wait, have I? I hope not. I talk to myself a lot. Yes. Duct tape, flip flop, burp, derp, 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 derp. All right, well, this is easily going to take at least a good 15 to 30 minutes. See you guys then. Maybe. Let's see how we do on the first time. Harp. Nope. Uh. Case. Uh. Jump. Nice. Woohoo! All right, power options. Start auxiliary generators. Engine core power restored. Engine for power. Thermal yep, there's the art. Yep, Prime. we're gonna. It's standing by for your gonna. command. Command accepted. <laughs> Commencing five second countdown. Ah. Five. This ain't Four. looking so good. <laughs> He's like, what's up, dude? I'm gonna beat you with a stick. <laughs> This is the longest five seconds of my entire life. Alright, barbecued scents coming on up. Doosh. It's good news. Yeah, I'm not walking out there, by the way. He's okay, because power armor. Wow, that's a really hot flame. Do they actually test those indoors? Ah, I can't run. With an efficiency rating of 96. Okay, 212. Uh, operator, it broke my leg. I need to drop something for dropping this. I need to drop more somethings. No, I need to do drugs. That solves all of my problems. In Fallout, of course. In Fallout. No, no other... No, do not do drugs. They are bad. For your human body needs. Uh... Water. Okay, there we go. Leg no longer broken. Other stuff no longer other stuff. Oh my god, are you alright? Oh my god. Cooked by those flames. But thanks to my power armor, I'm still in one piece. The important thing is that we're still alive. We have a way to get to the transmitter. Let's go. Ah, ah, bug! Alright. I wasn't lying about that take everything and cry about it later thing. There are so many. So many weapons here. I need them all. This is so much money. All right, all right, okay. Prioritize the loot. Uh, loot over health. Don't ever say that in real. Life. Don't ever do that in real life. Loot is never never worth your health. Okay. You're over in Cooper and cannot run, huh? I wonder why. <laughs> Couldn't have anything to do with the fact that I'm carrying like 500 pounds worth of. Loot. Good it. Ow. Okay. 
going up. Where's Pella Doom Dane? I heard something. Are you are you good? Dog, you know what? You're staying down there. I'm not coming down there for you. You put yourself in that mess. I don't know what the heck he thought he was thinking, but... Synth, synth, synth striders. We're gonna stay hidden. We're gonna let him do his thing. Where he goes all Rambo. Because, you know, Paladin Dance is pretty much Rambo. And this synth can no longer do stuff without a leg. Ow. Okay. So, I need... I need... This stuff. Why did I miss that? Terminating with extreme prejudice. Let's get out of here. Okay. That was the Terminator. I'm killing you with extreme prejudice. I'm gonna take all of this stuff. It's all mine. Loot chest right here. It's not worth it really. But hey, taking it anyway. Uh, yeah. Ow. We need to get out of here. Dying. Dog meat is dead. Although he didn't get killed by the hordes of robots. He literally only got killed from wanting to take a swan dive into a... I don't know what that was. It hurts my feelings that he did that. In here. In here, team. Okay? Uh. Paladin Dance. Oh, now we're not on talking terms? Okay. I see how it is. That's my feelings there, bud. <gasps> Ow. Bunker looks clear. Let's move out. Yes, sir, Rambo. In control, sir. I can't handle any more loot. That hurt my... my this hurts my legs. Paladin. Well, that could have gone smoother, but uh -huh. mission accomplished. Yes. Smoother? I thought we did fine. We're both alive and the transmitter's been secured. Aw. I thought we worked well as a team. Agreed. It's a refreshing change to work with a civilian Ow. who can follow orders properly. That being said, I believe we have two important matters to discuss. First and foremost, if you'll hand me the deep range transmitter, I'd like to compensate you for your assistance during this operation. Sure, here I you go, you'll bud. I think find this weapon useful. It's my own personal modification of the standard Brotherhood laser rifle. May it Wait. serve you well in battle. The Righteous Authority. Critical shots do double damage and critical minion feels 15% faster. We're making you into a sniper. Thank you. You're welcome, civilian. Now, as far as the second matter goes, I wanted to make you a proposal. We had a lot thrown We're getting married? Here. Our op could have ended in disaster, but you kept your cool and handled it like a soldier. There's no doubt in my mind you've got what it takes. The way I see it, yes. you've got a choice. You could spend the rest of your life wandering from place to place, trading an extra hand for a meager reward. Uh-huh. Or you could join the So, what do you say? Sure, I'll join. I'd be honored to join. That's what I wanted to hear. Meet me back at the police station, and we'll discuss the details. All right. I have answered the call to arms. And gotten a level up from it. Sweet! Let's head back to the police station. I might speed this part up and stuff, because... Semper Invicta. And Victorium! <clears throat> 
I mean, for the Minutemen. I mean, for the railroad. Ah, I I we'll figure it out somehow. For the people. I like that better. So, there's really no point in me wasting my carry weight stuff. But both my legs are broken. Uh. There's no way I'm going to be able to survive. So, we're going to speed this up a bit. That's a combat shotgun. All right, time to do some drugs. Got him. All right. Okay, let's add a little bit more loot to my broken leg style or pile. I can't believe I survived that. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and keep speeding this. Supervisor Green. I'll go ahead and put on our little bitty, our frickin' our merchant look. Ready to begin your fabulous shopping spree? Yes. Yeah, all right. He is very broke. You gotta be scamming me. Thank you. All right, the rest we're going to store. I'll get some water here. Water. Where is the workbench? <laughs> Ow. Uh, this is taking forever. like that. A lot of stuff here. Got a lot of stuff.
Bada bing, bada boop, bah. That almost killed us. We need to see a doctor. With this, we commit our friend. One moment. We gotta do something of interest. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Excuse me. Blake was a great guy and an even better friend. He was taken from us too soon. Oh. He won't be forgotten. Blake, I hope you know how I felt about you. Even if I couldn't say it to your face. Now you're gone. It seems too late. But I love you. Marcus, do you have anything to say? This is stupid. People die every day. I don't understand why. Understand. <laughs> God, why did it have to be him, huh? Why wasn't it me? There are still funerals the held in the wastelands? I'm the one had it coming, not him. Not Blake. I'm sorry, guys. I just... I miss him as all. We all miss him, Marcus. He was the best of all of us. Thanks, guys. <clears throat> I'm okay now. Really, I am. Okay. That's it. There's nothing else we can do now. Time to move on. Yes. <clears throat> huh? Huh? I dig your outfit, dude. I should I should kill you for it, but I know I'm, I'm not an asshole. All right. Yes. If I was a raider, that'd be different. Time to continue. Okay, so dudes, that was a funeral. I have never seen that little bit of stuff there at all, you know? So that's cool. Uh, hopefully we won't get smacked up by more feral ghouls because they are all over this town. And I do not know why the Brotherhood of Steel decided to make their operational base here, but it, I mean, it's just not tactically sound. Not safe. Why would you be here? Well, sir. Are we in luck, sir? Mission... We're all go. Okay. Accomplished. We have the transmitter. Finally, some good news for a change. Nice work, sir. I didn't do it alone. Aelin, Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the recon team. He shows a lot of promise. And with the proper guidance, I think he has the potential of becoming one of the best. Oh, that's sweet. That is so sweet. Okay. Thanks. We'll let you down. not to let you down. You don't have to prove anything else to me. Getting that transmitter was enough. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. I got tired of wandering alone. Too bad. I was getting used to the thought of you leaving. Reese, that's enough. Like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you, you need to understand what it means to be a part of the Brotherhood. Hey, We're don't jump down my neck. We're an army. And we've dedicated our lives to uphold a strict code of ethics. If you intend to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our tenets without question. Don't worry. I've spent time in the military. Perfect. Then there's no need to give you a long lecture. So I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order and you follow it. It's as simple as that. Now, before I release you to Halen and Reese, You know, this is the first time I've seen him without his Buzz Lightyear thing on. From this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of Initiate. This is only a training rank. I'm not permitted to grant ranks any higher than that. Thank you. Thanks aren't necessary. Just continue excelling at your duties, soldier. Ad Victorium, Initiate. He doesn't even know what that means, Halen. Ad Victorium means to victory. In our eyes, defeat is unacceptable because we're fighting for the future of mankind. Our rallying cry is more powerful than any weapon you could ever carry. Remember that. Now, mm. I need you to report to Halen or Reese for your- So if I run. scream at my enemies, they will die? Soldier. Is what you're saying. To victory! <sighs> oh. 
That'd be cool, though. Did the stuff stay here? It did. The stuff did stay here. And I can't move again. But I'm still under the weight that I need to be to be able to move. Uh, I like mozzarella sticks. Okay, team, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you haven't done it yet, go ahead and leave a subscribe if you want to be notified when I drop the next episode. And if you like this episode, go ahead and leave a like. It helps me out a lot. Also, uh, don't forget about that question I asked you at the beginning of the video. Either way, there's going to be some stuff down in the description dip. If you want to check that out and help me out that way. Either way, have a great one and see you on the next one.